Right, so a controversy also make her news, uh, give a news value. And then we have a prominence. Prominence is uh, if a prominent person in, involved in any event. So, yeah, for example, like uh, if that someone is someone, is somebody, right? For example, that uh, we're talking about Ustaz Abid Yu. Uh, he is a well known man in Malaysia who's doing good deeds. So, um, if the news about him spread to public, so it is definitely become a news because people know him. Prominence. Okay. Currency. Uh, currency is about the you know, current event. Okay. Happens to be uh, this year we have um, Olympic in Tokyo, but um, it has to be suspended. So, that is also news. Uh, oddity. Oddity is the unusual things, okay, unusual things that might um, create a public interest, okay, for example, like, I've read the news about uh, a boy who punched into a crocodile eye, so <laughs> that is definitely unusual things to do, because we never ever thought about punching into a crocodile eyes. Okay, but in order to survive, that boy did that. So it's if I'm not mistaken, it's in Sarawak. Um, so that is a news. Okay, and then we have emotions. Okay, stories who have um, emotions of human interest that will be uh, make a good news item. For example, like um, uh, helping the poor people, or um, we have we even providing uh, lunch or giving. We're donating for the frontliners, so these kind of stories that have human interest are going to be a good news item. Okay. Usefulness, okay, usefulness. Uh, for example, that you're sharing information about uh, how to how to prevent coronavirus by um, washing your hands regularly, using hand sanitizer, wearing masks, so that kind of things. The usefulness will help the public in various ways, so that is also become the news. Okay. Last but not least, number 10 is educational value. Um, quite similar uh, to the usefulness because educational value, we have an education values, for example, that um, in the uh, newspaper, you have an educational values of learning about the marketing, learning about um, uh, recipes for cooking. So that, that kind of things has an educational value. So adding up the educational values for your uh, day to day life routine will definitely give some news value. Okay. So, how to choose a communication channel? Well, the dissemination will, defi will be defined based on your targeted audience. If you're looking for someone that is love to see the visual uh, and audio, then definitely television is the best um, communication channel. So, you know that you should invite not a reporter, but you should invite a journalist with the uh, cameraman or video man, okay. So, okay, this is actually which of the communication channels that you you should choose, okay. For you can see for television, it's for it's actually uh, quite similar for televisions and radio. Instead of that, uh, number two, the uh, the TV will provide a clear visual and audio explanation, while radio only uh, audio explanation. Um, television directly from sources. Same goes to the radio, but radio only available in certain area. Uh, both of these can be delayed or can be on time on certain news and feedback. Um, television can provide subtitles and language translator, but uh, radio we don't have that. And then television can be suitable for every one of us, even if you are uh, with the impairment of um, blind and Deaf, you can still um, understand the news, but for radio, it's only suitable for those without hearing problems, okay? Um, because it only provides the audio. Okay? Printed uh, for mass audience, social media as well, but um, printed need you need to be very good in visual and written. You should be good in writing, okay? Social media has no border. Printed may be exploited by the journalist or the editor. Social media may cause hot fakes, uh, news statements, and so on. Uh, printed 
can be direct different resources yet edited but the social media might not come from direct from the sources it may may be copied uh, from the internet no gatekeeping for social media uh, there is a gatekeeping for printed delete time on news and feedback fast spreads and response for social media printed is suitable for those with reading ability and social media is something that can be accessed by anyone so I guess that is all for today's chapter. Hope that you understand about analyzing your communication channel and spreading out your informations. And I hope that you will also understand the news values. You will see this news value again on the chapter 8, if I'm not mistaken, uh, because we learn about news, uh, newsworthiness. Okay. Uh, until then, thank you so much for your participation today. Hope to see you soon. Selamat puasa. Jangan buka-buka tudung kuyuk di awal puasa. Uh, selamat berbuka juga kepada anda semua Semoga yang mana berada jauh daripada keluarga Akan sentiasa berada dalam lindungan Allah SWT Semoga dipermudahkan urusan uh, anda semua Untuk pulang ke kampung insyaAllah ya, Mana yang tak dapat pulang ke kampung dan yang bersedih uh, Allah telah menyediakan satu persediaan Ataupun satu perancangan yang baik untuk anda Urusan kebaiklah kerana hanya dengan urusan kebaiklah Kita akan mendapat perkara-perkara yang baik insyaAllah So um, that is all for today uh, See you guys on the next class Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh